What's up you guys? We're back with another top figure video. In this channel, we share the truth about entrepreneurship, the back ends, the front ends, everything. So before we get started, can you guys smash the like button, click subscribe, and make sure you turn on the notifications so you know every time we drop a video. So what do we wanna talk about today? Today we're gonna to talk about the truth, the hardcore truth about entrepreneurship. This is gonna be a good topic. You're gonna wanna sit back and enjoy this video. Before you start the online business, you need to hit a team top figure. Trying to compound on the road to some millions. You need to hit a team top figure. So Sal, let's get into it. What is the truth about entrepreneurship? You know, on Instagram, it's this glamorous lifestyle, right? Mm -hmm. It's this amazing thing. It's this, it's something that everybody wants to be. But let's talk about the truth behind it. Honestly, it, the thing is, it also shocked us when we first got into entrepreneurship too. Mm -hmm. Like when we first got into it, we were thinking, yo, we're gonna have less time to work. We're mm -hmm. gonna be working less, mm -hmm. taking more vacations. And mm -hmm. honestly, a lot of that really is not the truth in the beginning. And honestly, it really doesn't become that for a very long time. The thing is, when you start off in any journey of e-commerce or whatever business that you're in, mm -hmm. you're going to fail a lot. That's just a guaranteed fact of it. You're not gonna succeed right away and you're gonna also face new challenges at every level you get to. And that's the shocking reality that we face and we still, to this day, uh, yeah. you know, fail every single day. Mm, that's super important. You see, there's reality and then there's social media. 100%. And the most important thing is Never compare your chapter one to someone's chapter 20. With social media right now, it's so easy. I'm talking about it is so easy to feel down on yourself, to feel like you're behind, to feel like you're not where you should be, to feel like things are just not clicking for you and everybody else is in a Ferrari or flying private or doing this or doing that. And you feel so behind when in actual re reality is entrepreneurship is not meant for everybody and here that's just the honest truth and i don't want to lie it's just not made for everybody you got to give up a lot of your friends you got to be willing to adapt let me be honest with you guys about the adapt part right a year ago you would have looked at me crazy if i'm walking around like this if we're walking around yeah. like this a year ago you guess what? Like, what they would look <laughs> at us like we're crazy right and today if you don't have this on you look crazy so guess what? Everybody has to adapt to that, right? And you see how fast things change and you see how everything is changing. A lot of businesses actually had to shut down this year because they couldn't adapt, right? And as an entrepreneur, your greatest skill is how fast you can adapt, right? You see these things are coming. You have to be prepared and just a, not everybody's met for that, right? And what is it that makes an entrepreneur a great leader, right? What are the actual things that makes an entrepreneur great? And honestly, the biggest thing is like Elon Musk said this and uh, to go off your point, basically you know, on Clubhouse, he said something that was huge. Somebody asked the question on Clubhouse. What do you do as far as getting perseverance? Like what, what, yeah, what encouragement? Like what? How do you get that every single day as an entrepreneur? And Elon literally his response was, if you need constant encouragement, just don't be an entrepreneur. If you don't have that within your nature of just like natural born, I feel like being a leader is you have to have that nature like just naturally instilled, instilled within you, mm -hmm. you know? So that's a huge part of it, right? And the thing is like some people are not just cut off for it and yeah. it might not be that for a lot of people, so. But guess what though? Here's the great part, right? Just because you're not a number one, right? You're not the entrepreneur, doesn't mean you can't work under somebody. There's 100%. people Ego who thrive. Yeah, here's the actual truth, right? There's people who thrive working under somebody, right? There's literally people who do better working under somebody because they don't want that pressure. They don't want that stress. They just want to thrive at what they're good at, right? And as an entrepreneur, one of the best things you can do is understand that and understand there's going to be people working with you. There's going to be people who come around. They necessarily don't want to be an entrepreneur. They just want to work under you and help you build your vision, right? No company is done alone, right? So it's like, don't feel down on yourself just because it's not cut out for you. And here are the hard truth part. A lot of entrepreneurs fail. 
100%. This is the hard truth. A lot, a lot of entrepreneurs fail. So the, the one percent that you're seeing that's actually winning on social media, that's not everybody, right? And a so, lot of it's fake. Mm -hmm. Like, don't get it twisted. A lot of the behind, nobody's sharing their failures on social media. Everybody's fa showing their successes and their wins. Like, mm -hmm. that's the biggest thing too as well. We constantly talk about our entire journey from mm -hmm. start to finish, and we're very transparent with you guys. That's the number one thing because honestly, without transparency, we don't want to sell a fake vision and a fake reality that doesn't exist you know and this video we really wanted to talk about the truth about it just because you know there's too many things talking about like yo become an entrepreneur overnight like yo you're you're gonna go up overnight and that's just not the truth and a lot of people are gonna fail you know a lot of people are not gonna make it and that's okay and that's the thing it's, it's okay nothing there's, nothing there's nothing wrong, wrong with that. that a lot of people are not cut yeah off. and let's get on to the next thing right so we, there's a lot of failures that come with it you know you have to cut out a lot of friends and here's the most important thing you need to watch your environment like I don't I don't I cannot explain how big this is right this is literally one of the make or break things if you're in a toxic environment what whether it's like you know friends that's bringing you down acquaintances in a relationship whatever it is when you're trying to be an entrepreneur you're actually trying to make something this is when you need all that energy going towards whatever you're doing and if you're literally around negative energy you're bound to fail like almost 100% of the time. 100%, like that's the first thing we did when we first started off, we surrounded ourselves with people who are better than us, smarter mm -hmm. than us, more have way more money than us, mm -hmm. and it just pushed us to be more uncomfortable every single day. And that uncomfort nature allowed us to just realize, hey, we need to constantly be uncomfortable every day mm -hmm. because you're not gonna grow if you're not gonna be you know, uncomfortable. So that's the huge part of really starting off in entrepreneurship. Just go ahead and separate yourself from people who are not gonna benefit you or take you to the next level. It's not like a bad thing when you have to like just let go of some people. This is actually for your own good, right? So it's like right now, a lot of us just want to hang out with friends. A lot of us want to hang out with people, but it's important who you're hanging around with because the one thing we can never get back is our time. You know, you can always get money back. You can always get things back. Everything you can get back. But your time, that's something you can never, ever, ever, I mean, ever get back. 100%. You want to make sure that you spend the right time wisely. Like, look at it like you're every time in the day, you have 83,000, how, mm -hmm. however much seconds that they're under in a day. Yeah. Like, look at that as a dollar, you know? Exactly. And honestly, just figure out, okay, if you're spending the amount of time, you wouldn't spend money on yeah. just wasting your time wasting. with somebody like for a good amount of time. It's not bringing you any, any sort of revenue, right? Yeah. Any sort of really growth, you know? It doesn't have to be necessarily money in the beginning because you're not going to make money in the beginning as an entrepreneur. We didn't make a dollar for two, what, how long is it? A year and a half almost. Yeah. Almost it was a year. I think it was like a year. We're just hustling it. We didn't really make real, real money. Yeah. But the, the thing that that year actually taught us was the truth about entrepreneurship like the things we didn't hear before like i quit my job right the things that i'm literally seeing on social media all these people winning i'm like yo like this person's doing it? like that this person, seems easy well, this seems easy man let me let me just and it's just uh, yeah, reality just boop, <laughs> come back <laughs> right there's this quick story i want to share before we wrap this up right so when i when i first started entrepreneurship one of the main things I was doing was I was going to networking events. This was actually one of the things that like helped me a lot. Like when I mean a lot, it helped me a lot. Just because, you know, I didn't like talking a lot. You know, I didn't know like how to network. I didn't know. Like, these were all uncomfortable things, right? And I, I just said I had to get uncomfortable every single day to grow. If I'm not uncomfortable, that means I'm not growing. That means I'm staying at the same pace. That's not good for me and that's not going to help me grow. So I started going to these networking events. And I met a specific entrepreneur and I just asked him, and this guy was a millionaire, you know, and I just asked him like, yo, you know, why are you still out here grinding and like, why are you still like working? And then he said, man, here's the truth, right? As an entrepreneur, our paychecks are never guaranteed. That's the truth. Nothing is guaranteed as an entrepreneur. Tomorrow, he said, I can go broke for all I know, right? So every single day, I have to work harder than the person that's out there getting me. This guy makes a lot of money and he's crushing it. But this man shows up every single time and he grinds every single time. And then that just was the moment it really hit me. It's like if this successful guy is crushing it 
and he shows up. He literally told me his routine. He wakes up 4 a.m. every single day and he goes home around 8 p.m. every day. That's his work schedule, Monday to Friday. And he's been like doing that for years, he said, right? And then I just sat back and I, I looked at the reality. I'm like, wait, wait, wait. So it's not like, like you don't just go on boats, vacation every day. Like, right, that's right, not, yeah. But I thought that's what I seen on Instagram, it's right? It's like a facade, <laughs> You know? So it's like, that's the actual truth, guys. I want you guys to understand, for those of you guys that are getting into entrepreneurship right now, it's not, you know, candles and sunlight and, you know, you're gonna go through the storm, right? There's gonna be bad days. There's gonna be times where you feel alone. There's gonna be times where no one's there for you. Your parents don't understand you. People, your friends don't understand what you're going through. You know, like you're, you're thinking of giving up, you know, it's so tough. You're on your last time. You're just like, this isn't working out. This isn't working out. But here's the thing that makes a lot of entrepreneurs entrepreneurs sticking through it those are the ones that survive right and that's when you know it's really meant for you and you're gonna really start seeing the results later on because nothing happens overnight right if you hear anybody like guys please listen to me if you hear any anybody's telling you there's overnight success and it's guaranteeing you stuff run the complete other way because they're lying to you and it's just the truth is this isn't an easy game right but it's the most rewarding Right? If you stick through it, it's the most rewarding. And I think anybody could be an entrepreneur, but not everybody has the work ethic. And that's okay. That's what we're talking about today. That's okay. 100%. If you guys like the content we're sharing with you guys, yes. go ahead and make sure to smash the like button. Smash that so like can, button. Hold on. So what we can are you keep for? making content like this and really just, you know, we want you guys to really always constantly grow and take it to the next level. And we're always raw with you guys. This channel, we're going to share the truth about entrepreneurship, 100%. not no facade. If you're here for a facade, you can watch those motivation pages. We're not here to do that. We're here to share the actual truth, the back ends, and showing you guys our full journey as we're on our way to. So okay. Come along with us, smash the like button, make sure you click subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and comment, and we'll see you guys on the next video. Take care, y'all.